This is our Engineering 183 class where the students design a roller coaster. First they model it with physics and then they construct some design using uh, some CAD software. And then afterwards they build their coasters and test them. We have uh, sensors that are instrumenting the uh, coaster at various points to uh, measure the velocity of the ball as it goes along the track. And they're entered into the computer through a digital acquisition system and then they compare the actual speed that is measured from the sensors versus the speed that they theoretically calculate and then calculate a percent error. So this is their design project for the quarter. It's beautiful. Alright, when we started out designing the roller coaster, we had to work from the bottom up. We started with, you know, we had to get all the specifics and the requirements and whatnot. And we knew we wanted to do something unique and uh, just unordinate. So we started out, we had the idea we wanted to do a full upward horizontal and a couple downward verticals. Um, and then basically what happened is a lot of these features just came together as we worked on um, your computer. What they have is this uh, software. They, they didn't start the timing, but each of these sensors on here measures the velocity at various points in the coaster track. So what, do you have your uh, velocity coming down? I didn't move. Um, that's about 2 point, what is it, 2.7 point meters at the bottom. Yeah. Okay, very good. When you guys are explaining your loop, can you tell us what loops are what? Like you said, helix and... This is the uh, upward horizontal loop. It's about a half loop. It's not a completely full loop. And this is the downward or the horizontal loops right here. Obviously, this is the vertical loop. And then we have the bump. Okay. After building this, would you... Would you be more or less comfortable going to the point and riding the roller coaster? <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, it's it's all more than more comfortable. comfortable. I feel like people were qualified. <laughs> I, feel like not, I feel like they had less trial and error. <laughs> and plus, we're not riding on a little polyurethane balls. Yeah. <laughs> you could see their box design's a little shallow. Yeah. And so it was interesting. They had to slow theirs down enough because after they got done with their loops, they didn't have a lot of vertical height left, right. so <laughs> they had a little bit of a challenge trying to design that little box to catch yeah, it without it's quite, quite a clever out. design. It works very well. I for what it's we want to do. Who came up with the spring loaded? <laughs> <laughs> oh, you had a patent. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. Next. Bum out, 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 bum out